Sir, a mother's heartbreak, a family in mourning. Tonight, a grieving mother speaking out in hopes that the men responsible for fatally stabbing her 15-year-old son are brought to justice. And News 12, the Bronx reporter Carmen Grant is in Belmont with more details for us. Carmen. Amanda Eric, it was here at this spot where a group of men viciously dragged that 15-year-old from the store onto the sidewalk, stabbing him to death. Right a few feet away, a growing memorial for a young man everyone in the community knew as Junior. A mother's grief. I don't know what am I going to do without him. Over the brutal stabbing of her 15-year-old son, her youngest. My baby. My baby. Leandra Felice says the past 24 hours has been a daze, a nightmare she can't wake up from. They kill me and they leave me alive. These chilling images shows her son, Lisandro Guzman Felice, being dragged out of a bodega on East 183rd Street by a group of men Wednesday night. One of those suspects, police say, stabbed the teenager in the neck with a machete. I see the a machete in the hand in the guy who has the red shirt. Felice viewing the video of her son's horrific stabbing for the first time and seeing the man who police say took his life. But he's looking for him inside the grocery store. Mm -hmm. He are looking for him. Police aren't sure what led to the deadly stabbing, but they believe a dispute broke out between Felice and the knife-wielding man. Don't hit him with a big machete like that. You know, this is a criminal. This is from the devil. Meanwhile, Felice's angry birds hasn't been moved from the couch, the last place where he sat with his mother just before leaving that night, as well as this text message to his brother-in-law telling his family he's on his way home. He said, yo, I'm coming home soon. Fall asleep if you want. And then I call him twice, but he was never a reply again. Now this fatal stabbing has touched some local celebrities, including Cardi B, who is using the hashtag justice for Junior. Meanwhile, there is a $2,500 reward for anyone having information on this fatal stabbing. That's the latest here in Belmont. Carmen Grant, News 12, The Bronx.